Hi guys. So in this video, we are going to go over how to record bill payments in QuickBooks Online. So same process, click on new, then click on pay bills. Here you can pick multiple bills for the same vendor or one payment per vendor or um, multiple payments to multiple vendors. So what we are doing is we are picking two payments for the same vendor which QuickBooks is going to total like $300 plus $1,000. Let's say we pay two bills at the same time. And then this test vendor, we have another $500 payments to rec payment to record. How did we pay it? We paid it through our checking account. Oops, wrong checking account. This checking account and payment date was, let's say 11.5. And check number, there's no check number. These were ACH payments and we paid it online. So that's it. We are going to say save and close. Okay. Another way of doing it is through the banking window. When the transactions get pulled by QuickBooks Online through your bank account, we can go to banking. Okay. Now here's what happens. We have to record this payment for January 5th, 2023. Now this is super old transaction. It's almost a year old. It's been 10 months since we made this payment. We have not recorded it in the books. QuickBooks Online is not great when it comes to like past transactions. I would say past 90 days. Sometimes it tries to find a match, other times it doesn't. So this time it's not finding a match, so we're gonna find it manually this time. So you will click on this transaction, click on find match, and see here, when you have a lot of bills, um, you might want to search, for example, BNY is my vendor and then click here, or you can click on this one open bill. This is the bill. I know my payment was for this bill. So I'm going to record it here. Save. Yep. That's it. So that's how you would record it manually and or through online banking.